Before we get started, and for those joining us for the first time, I'm Joanne Toller and I'm a nonprofit coach with over 30 years of experience in the field. And every week I bring you practical fundraising and nonprofit marketing tips, including digital and social media fundraising. So hit the subscribe and the notifications and let's get started with fundraising letters that get funded. Starting strong is essential in crafting effective fundraising letters, and that strength begins with a well-crafted header. Now I'm going to skip over the logo and the date because I know you just want to hear the good stuff, but make sure that your header on your donation letters includes these crucial elements. And even recipient address is important. In this era of mass emails and generic ads, personalization in your nonprofit letters can make all the difference. It's an old age principle in fundraising for nonprofits. Personalization promotes participation. So with the initial formalities in place, we're at the heart of your nonprofit fundraising letter, the opening statement. This is where you captivate your reader and set the tone for the entire appeal. In fundraising for nonprofit organizations, you're not just competing against other causes, you're competing against a world full of distractions. Your opener should be a magnetic pull. So here's a pro tip. Take the extra mile in personalizing your greetings. Do your research. If you're aware that the recipient is an advocate in your sector, you can open by acknowledging that. By connecting shared values, you're crafting a bridge between your nonprofit and the donor's passions. For corporate donors, I often dig into their corporate value statements and align those in my opening. I will also call the person I am addressing the letter to and have a conversation, which not only makes them aware and ready to receive my request, but allows me the opportunity to get to know them a little better for better personalization. I also like to begin my letters with a powerful fact or statistic that resonates. For instance, did you know that every 10 minutes a child in our community goes to bed hungry? Facts like these instantly create a sense of urgency and engagement. You could also relate to something tangible or widely understood like imagine a world where every sip of water you take could harm you. That's the reality for 1,000 families right at our doorstep. Once you've caught the reader's attention, it's crucial to channel that focus. This means providing a clear picture of the issue or cause your nonprofit is addressing. You might be tempted to delve deep into the background, but remember, clarity is key. The point is that your opening statement is the foundation for your nonprofit fundraising appeal. It needs to be powerful, precise, and paint a picture of the mission at hand. Remember, the goal is not just to inform, but to inspire action. After setting the stage, with an opening statement, it's time to delve into the heart of your nonprofit fundraising letter, the story. Storytelling is the art of human connection and a bridge between hearts and minds. While statistics and facts inform, stories transform. Now, we did a video on nonprofit narratives and storytelling, which I will link here and in the description. When fundraising, one real heartfelt story can create a ripple effect of generosity. Choose a story that embodies the essence of your mission. For example, if you're raising funds for an education initiative, narrate the journey of a child from your program who, against all odds, managed to excel academically in attributing their success to the support your nonprofit provided. Just remember, authenticity is key. Don't embellish or exaggerate. Let the genuine emotions shine through. A donor can feel the difference between a genuine appeal and a manufactured one. Use emotive language and imagery. While the story is the core, the words you use tell it and the imagery you invoke can amplify this emotional resonance. Use vivid descriptions and active verbs. Instead of simply saying John found school helpful, you could say every morning John eagerly raced to school, his sanctuary where each lesson lit up his world. Finally, where possible and with permission, consider including relevant photos or artwork in your nonprofit fundraising letter. A single powerful image like a radiant smile of a beneficiary or a community coming together can encapsulate the entire essence of your cause. Every great story has a purpose. In our cause, it's to inspire action. So after taking your reader on an emotional journey, it's time to pivot a moment. The ask. After sharing your story, your reader is emotionally invested and wants to help. Guide them how they could be part of the solution. Keep it straightforward. If you're looking for monetary donations, say so explicitly. We're reaching out to kind souls like you to help us continue our mission. If you need volunteers or material resources, make sure you specifically say, lend us your time or donate essential supplies. While a general ask is good, specis, specis, oh, I knew I wouldn't be able to say this, specific can greatly boost the effectiveness of your appeal. When donors know precisely how 
how their contributions will be used, they feel a deeper sense of purpose and connection. You can also break down in bullet points, because readability is a thing, the impact of your difference donation amounts make. For example, $25 can provide a month's worth of meals for a family, or $100 can sponsor a child's education for an entire year. One of the most compelling motivators for someone to donate to your cause is understanding the why behind their contribution. After making the ask, it's crucial to let your supporters know how their donations will make a difference. This is where we explain the impact. In the world of fundraising, transparency isn't just a buzzword, it's a bond of trust. When donors see firsthand the changes their contributions bring about, they feel an intrinsic passion of the mission. Narrate the ripple effect. If you're fundraising for education, explain your generous donations don't just buy books. They open doors to brighter futures, creating opportunities and fostering dreams. You can also use testimonials or success stories from previous beneficiaries. Numbers also have a story to tell. When donors know precisely how their funds will be used, it reinforces their commitment and trust in your nonprofit. Consider using infographics or visual aids in your fundraising letters or accompanying materials. A visual representation such as a pie chart showing where funds are allocated can be both engaging and informative. While the core motivations to donate stems from empathy and the desire to make a difference, it's only human for some individuals or businesses to appreciate a token of gratitude or a tangible benefit in return. You can clearly lay out any benefits a donor might receive, like how donations are eligible for tax receipts or how contributions of, say, $1,000 or more will be acknowledged in your donor wall. Offering exclusive experience can be a unique incentive Perhaps we organize an annual tour of our programs for top donors, allowing them to witness the impact firsthand. Whatever the recognition, remember that fundraising for nonprofits is a dance in trust and gratitude. Now, after crafting a heartfelt, compelling narrative and making a transparent, respectful ask, it's time to channel this momentum into action. Here's where we place our call to action. Now, this is different from the ask, it's the next steps. Think of it as a compass for your reader, a simple, clear, and direct guide on what to do next. Your reader is moved and they are willing to help. Now they need clear, simple steps to do so. So spell it out. Ease and convenience are key. The simpler you make the process for your donors, the more likely they are to complete it. So take advantage of things like direct links to donation pages, self-addressed stamped envelopes, or QR codes. We did a video on that too, which I'll link here and in the description. Next up is gratitude, which is the heart of philanthropy. While it's customary to express gratitude post-contribution, thanking a potential donor beforehand acknowledges their willingness to even consider helping, valuing their time and intention. Recognizing this in your nonprofit fundraising letter not only seals your message, but creates a sense of warmth and appreciation. Preemptive gratitude makes individuals feel seen and valued, sometimes even before they've made a decision to donate. Finally, the power of the PS or postscript. Now in your nonprofit fundraising letter, this cannot be understated. It's the last little nudge, a soft whisper in the reader's ear that can make all the difference. It might be surprising to you, but in the vast sea of words in a letter, the PS is a lighthouse catching the reader's attention often before the main content even does. So think of the PS as your encore, a chance to leave a lasting impression. Again, keep it concise, compelling, and aligned with the heart of your message. Trust me on this, a well-crafted PS can often be the difference between a letter that's appreciated and one that compels action. What you choose to include in your postscript is crucial. It can be a point in reminder, a heartwarming statistic, or even an exclusive offer, but it should feel like a natural continuation of your letter, adding value, not just being an afterthought. In the world of nonprofit work where passion meets purpose, a fundraising letter is not merely a tool, it's a bridge between supporters and the cause they believe in. Every element we've discussed from the header's first glance to the powerful nudge of the PS works harmoniously to communicate, connect, and compel. Now I've designed a comprehensive worksheet to simplify the process of crafting your nonprofit fundraising letter, complete with hands-on examples. Grab your free copy in the link here and in the description. And as you craft your nonprofit fundraising letter, let it reflect your mission's heart and the spirit of the community you serve. After all, when words meet purpose, magic happens. And don't forget to check out our QR code video. And until next week, keep inspiring and keep making a difference. Because as we all know, every drop counts in the ocean of change.